All right, people, welcome back. More vitamin Y. So today is Friday, and that means that we are using Super Vice, you know. So as you guys know, with the changes in effect, you will not be getting uh, videos from me on Saturday and Sunday, of course. Uh, I'm taking the weekends off now, which will uh, re... I don't know what word I want to say. <laughs> Rejuvenate me for the upcoming week. So let's go ahead and uh, end this week with a bang by using Super Vice, you know, of course. So, you got some interesting sleeves. Just the, the I mean, I'm, I'm, you guys probably know, have no idea what I'm talking about here, but his, the color scheme of his sleeves reminds me of a monster in Lost Hunter. Or the Devil, Devil Joe or Devil Ho? I don't know. I think it's Devil Joe, but it's like, it's like this, this deep green and then what's in like savage mode and has that red, so. Sorry. <laughs> I'm getting way off topic, but it just kind of reminds me of that. So double summon monk when I only have one single memory. That sounds that sounds pretty legit. <laughs> Too legit to quit. If I'm only really just set to one back row, so I guess we're gonna take this duel slow. You know, one back row and then nothing. So yeah, we'll just go ahead and poke you for 14. Well, I guess I'll go ahead and set these two and uh, pass to you, sir. So are you gonna reveal to me what deck you are playing? Are we going to take this duel extremely slow? No, it looks like we're going to take this duel extremely slow. So, of course, you guys know the rule of Yu-Gi-Oh! Monsters beat back row. Like, you can't win with just back row alone, because eventually I'm going to outpoke you. So you need to start playing. You need to summon a monster. You need to have a monster to back up that back row, and vice versa. You know, a deck with all monsters, not very successful. But a deck with all, all back row, also not very successful. You're not doing anything. I'm poking you. Poking you for 14, 14, 14. I'm not going to overextend. I'm not going to summon. I'm not going to, you know. Why? So you can torrential tribute me or something? Like, no, I'm good. I'm good. I'll poke the living crap out of you with Armageddon Knight. Wow. Wow. I was about to say, if I, if I literally win this duel because you do nothing, that's going to be a sad day. That's fine. You're going to use a fiendish chain on an Armageddon Knight who's poking the living shit out of you because you can't do anything. You're like, finish it out again because he's poking me. Like, there you go. That's the Toronto Tribute. That's what I was waiting for. That's that. I really don't care. You just wasted two pieces of back row for fucking Armageddon Knights. Like, really? Really? Armageddon Knights? Really? <laughs> like, Wow. Hmm. I could probably wrap this duel up. Yeah, I could probably wrap this duel up. Go ahead and call the hunter at least his um get in night back. Uh go ahead and see that card. Oh, it was Kapal, see? Like that a number generator, I see it. I see it. There's multiple steps during the end phase, so well, I'm going to see one that will resolve, and then I'll go ahead and summon Armageddon Knight. I'm going to drop Tinker, and now we are ready to go ahead and uh, sync it up. So, I'll like summon summon Monk Pitch, and summon a monster, and then go into Ptolemyus, and then go into Nova, and go into... No. <laughs> no. I think we'll just go ahead and swing it up. You know? Maybe it's other Geki Atom, just because I can end this duel if I throw their Geki Atom. So, yeah, we'll go ahead and do that. So, some the memories. We got a normal monster, which of course would be Doom Shaman. See? Aren't you glad I fucking MST that compulse? Nah, I can hold out. Use my normal summon. Oh, that's wrong. Summon four. Set. Set. Go ahead and special summon Tinker. And you two go ahead and contact. Well, contact. Synchro Shokan. Uh, yeah, we're going to Beals. Tinker effect. Let me see the top card. Do I want a dark reference? Of course I don't. I have all of them that I send. I, I would like to go ahead and see a uh, a revival card. Yeah. More I would better, especially since I can't end this game. Yep, wow. Wow. What 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 is your hand? Oh. What the fuck? What is your hand? It must just be some of the most cloggy. And I run you bell. Like, what is your hand? Just bullshit. Alright, I guess I'll give you an opportunity to do again. Like, I guess he wants to, he doesn't want to show me his hand because I guess he would reveal his deck. Because he really didn't reveal much, you know? 
You know, I don't. I, he only what played one monster, and that wasn't even enough for me to really know. Wow, and no back row either. Wow, and I'm so set up. Well, I need a little bit more revival, but like, wow, I can literally send everything to the grave right now. Yeah, I have no idea what you're playing, but that was a smart move, especially since you offered the rematch. Because all you had really had to do was reveal one monster, and I probably could have known what you're playing, even though it literally looks shaky and consistent. And I said, lots of back row, no monsters, makes you a unhappy person. So, I can literally send everybody, all three of them. So I drew you battle, which of course, Dark Bear will Pastry Bell, send Doom Shaman, go into Wild Chain, send Tinker, all three of them in the grave. All three of them are raring to go. They are ready. Their body is ready. Uh, where's Tinker? There you are. I just need some revival. We got triple voices, triple call of the haunted, triple swing, triple silent doom. Like, I would love to get one of them. Go ahead and play this just in deck then. Yeah, see, because MST is nice and all, but I'd rather just go ahead and get revival. So, hopefully, tack into this monster, reveal your deck. Pyramid Turtle. Oh. Alright, so I'm assuming you're gonna go ahead and summon that, uh, What's his name? The one that is half my life points? No. Oh, okay. It's vampires. Interesting. That's fine. No point throwing the regeki at you, because number two decided side to give me regeki again. Two duels in a row. So vampires. All right. I thought you were gonna summon. I forgot that monster's name. The one that gains half my my life points. So you summon it with like pyramid turtle. It's like a four thousand beater. Cause why the fuck not? Okay. Uh, so, once per turn, when a card is sent from opponent's deck to the graveyard, you can target one card. Ah, uh, yeah, so, you go up to, I was gonna take 200. Once per turn, when a card is sent from your point of view, you can target one card on the field. Send one dark vampire. I, I, uh, when you attack. No, I don't want to do that because then he could just make one on one and take me. Ah, fuck. Yeah, I'm going to lose my limit reverse. Yeah, because that this is activated during the damage step, so I can't even fucking play it. Either way, I'm screwed, so. So. So what I mill the top card from the top of my deck? Uh it's in the top card, yeah. Wow, and there goes my fucking soul charge. I would really like that. Yep, and kingdom effect, and then target a card in the field, I'm sure this is all during the damage step, so I can't even chain. That's fucking terrible. But if I did if I did something you build, then you're just like, okay, go to main phase two and make a one one. So either way I was gonna get it, so it didn't even matter. It didn't even matter. And of course, now, nah, mill my revival card. Nah, don't draw a revival card. Great. Fucking awesome. Fucking just fan fucking tastic. I'm gonna lose this duel. Wow. And then this is, it's like, no revival, no revival, no revival. Like, like, really? Really? Are you fucking shitting me right now, Dan? I really need some revival. This deck isn't anything without any revival. Huh. <sighs> Set this and then my turn. <clears throat> it's not looking good for me, people. Not at all. I didn't get any revival. You can pop my limit reverse. Use like a stall out with terror, but no. Nope. Mm hmm. Now I'm the one that gets a shitty hand. Yep. You know what? I should have MST'd that. Wow. You know what? You know what? I misplayed. I misplayed. I misplayed. Scoop it up. Nope. Nope. Yep. Scoop it up. Didn't get any revival. Wow. Didn't get any revival. Like, triple call. Triple oasis. Triple swing. Triple Silent Doom. That's fucking 12 cards in my fucking deck for Revival. Get none. Like, okay. Alright. Alright. 
Like, I don't even want to go to fucking round three. I don't even care. Like, you get a shitty duel, I get a shitty duel. There we go. We're even. Hmm. Sand's not bad. I don't know what speed I want to take it. I'm going to just go ahead and pitch one of my revival cards. Like I'm just crying for an act duel. Just to go ahead and get set up. Yeah. I'd rather go ahead and keep the MST. Pitch you. I see a Veiler. Go ahead and get this off. Right, good night. Back. Some Doom Shaman. I'll go into a Wobble Chain. Head. I'm instigating Clay right here. Clay is exactly what you want. Someone among banned because everybody, every deck can play it. Someone level 4 from the deck. Power. And I think it's limited in Yosu G. I, you know, ARG and a lot of people went with Wobble Chain banned. Like, it's just like, oh my god, just take my Ubell deck and throw it in the trash, right? Don't you? If they banned the Wobble Chain, then my Ubell deck will slow down to an incredibly slow pace. Like, holy crap. Oh, Teller Knights. Alright, well, I admit fucking defeat. There's no way I can fucking beat Teller Knights. Well, I got a good hand, too. I got a good hand, too. Good luck, have fun. I'm using fucking the Meta's deck. Like, no. I admit defeat. There's no fucking way. No fucking way. And you open up fucking busted. Like, nah. 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 You opened up fucking busted, too. Like, oh, yeah, all I did is open up Deneb, two Altairs, a Vega, a Phoenix Train, which, of course, I'm gonna loop with the fucking train, and, uh, uh, Solemn Morning. Mmm. Like, no. No. You don't say good luck, have fun, and use, like, one of the top six decks. Like, no. That's not fun at all. Wow. Wow, where's Dark fucking Greffer when you fucking need him? Like, wow. Dark guys, John Dark Greffer didn't even use him in the last couple of duels. Now I need him and he's not here. Like, wow. Yep. Or Summoner Monk. I kept on drawing Summoner Monk every fucking duel. I really would like Summoner Monk. Summoner Monk would be fan fucking tastic. No. Alright. 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 <laughs> I hate you fucking so much, DN. Why? Why do you troll me? Like, I need revival cards to get nothing. Wow, I can always join Summoner Monk and Dark Greffer. Oh, I'm glad that they're always with me. Then I clog my hand with fucking these two. Wow, you're gonna set a piece of it to go to your hand. Wow. Alright. This man. I'll just go ahead and break your fucking leg. You gonna run that fucking right deck? It's not a whole bunch of like normal level one monsters and shit. Okay. I have no idea where you're going with this. <sighs> Sometimes you just, just you know, if you're gonna run Teller Knights, take that fucking meta shit. Wow, foolish fucking soul charge, terror fucking doom shaman. No one's got a number generator. It's just fucking happy to see us today, isn't it? Oh wow, there you are a tuner. You want to uh, sync or something? Yep, synchro sync four five. Yep, sync five. Armadies. Librarian. What kind of fucking. No, no, no. You don't draw for it summon. For it summon. Oh my god, stop. Stop. You're so fucking bad. You don't draw for librarian summon. Like, wow, no. You draw for other Synchro Monster summons, not Librarian itself, fool. Yeah. <laughs> no! <laughs> no, you don't. It's not formula. Holy crap. Librarian has to be on the field to resolve its effect. So, how does it hit the field and resolve its effect on itself? That doesn't make any sense. That's why it literally says, this card must be face up on the field to activate and resolve this effect. That's why it doesn't count itself. Like, wow, really? Like, look. This card has to be face up on the field to resolve its effect. See you later.
account itself. Like, everybody knows that. Everybody knows that. TG does not count itself. If a monster or synchro summon draw a card, but the synchro summon has already resolved when TG Hyper Librarian hits the field. It doesn't make any sense. Oh my god. A librarian hits the field by its own summon. The synchro summon has already resolved. So you don't draw. Like, wow. Wow, and I bet you really would like that Silver's Cry, since that's what you drew. So go ahead and put that back and shuffle your deck, sir. Or you can just go ahead and quit. I don't really care. So. Oh. Or quit. I don't care. It's like, wow, why, why are people bad? Every single time. So many bad people on DN. But that's what happens when they have the system where you can literally do whatever you want. There you go. And it's fucking more and based on more of the fucking trust. <laughs> Anything, you know. I, mean, I get that you can't call an admin when you're doing unrated just because, you know, you're doing unrated rating, you know, doesn't matter and you know. God damn, look at these fucking high ass fucking people who want my fucking ass. Like, no thank you. Sorry, you're probably gonna come at me with your fucking necros or something, so let's calm that shit down. I don't mind doing scrubs because it's funny yelling at them and trying to teach them about fucking Yu-Gi-Oh. Your rating seems practical. Seems high enough to for you to know how to play Yu-Gi-Oh, but not too high where you'll just probably run a meta deck unless you just straight up one of them people. I don't, I don't, I get that you want to test your meta deck, but you know if you're running a meta deck, if you're running one of the top six decks, take that shit to rated. It's it's a meta deck. It's clearly made to be ran in the meta. Ah. Uh. Well, besides drawing Ultimate Nightmare, this hand's not terrible. Because, you know, Ultimate Nightmare's gonna do like. No. Well, well, you'll find out. I don't need to fucking tell you. So, I'll go ahead and summon another. Yeah, and I watch Drop the Bell. I'll do right, these two into Chain, of course. Yep. It is a U Bell deck. Go ahead and summon Doom Shaman. Set two. My turn. What deck are you running, sir? I said I'm not gonna quit this duel because this is gonna be the last duel of this video and of this episode of. Uh, and just when I said I wasn't gonna quit, great, great, infinity. I actually wanted to duel. Wow. <sighs> I said I wasn't gonna quit this duel. It's obvious! Oh my god, it's obvious! Are you fucking shitting me? Wow, wow, really? 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 How did you know it was Infinity? Nigga, you summon Cyber Dragon and Insta Fusion for fucking Panzer Dragon! It's fucking obvious! Oh my god! Here! That's it. I lose. Great. You're just gonna negate everything I fucking do. I can't stand monsters like Infinity. They're so fucking busted. All of them! You know what? You know what? You know what? I'll go ahead and just get another duel. I said I wasn't gonna quit this one, but it's pretty clear that I can't fucking win. It's fucking Infinity. God, I hate Infinity so fucking much. What's your deck anyway? It's all, you wanna do my Infinity deck? Good luck, have fun. It's Infinity, like nigga. I hate Infinity so much. Hate that card. Hate. Nigga, go the fuck away. Go the fuck away. I don't wanna face Infinity. And unrated, rated, or anything. I fucking hate that fucking piece of shit card. It should have been banned. I don't know what the fuck OCG was smoking. God. 
hate when you can just take out, take busted ass cards in the ocean, you can just bring them over here and then have them be busted. Wow, my hand's even worse than my fucking and then the last duel. Wow, at least I had summer months for the last duel. Draw Ultimate Nightmare again, and then nothing else. Great. Awesome. Awesome. Deanna's just fucking trolling me today. Yeah, I, I need my weekends off. I need my fucking weekends. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? You're doing that card wrong. That's not how that card works. Fusion support is not a fusion card. Once per turn, if you would fusion summon. No. No. If you would fusion summon a monster this turn, you can banish cards from your hand, grave, your, or your side of the field. So you pay high for your life points to just change how the fusion card works. It's not a, it's not a fusion card itself. That's why maybe why it's called fusion support. Holy fuck. Mind blown. If you would fusion summon the fusion monster this turn, you can go ahead and use other positions. Exactly. Exactly. So, so exactly. So it is not a fusion card itself. Just read it. Just read it. And it does. Just read it. Pay point. If you would fusion summon a monster this turn, as in play addition a different fusion card, you can banish cards from your hand, graveyard, or your side of the field. It's a fusion support card, not a fusion card itself. Like, read it. If you just read it, you will understand. Like I said, you'll probably be like, oh, I fucked up and quit anyway. I wanted to get one more duel in this video, but I... See? This is why I need to take weekends off! You know? No. Read it! Read it carefully. If you would... Fusion summon using a different card. Oh my god. Then you can fuse with. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's not that hard. It's not a fusion card itself. That's why it's called fusion support. That is why it is called fusion support. Support -a. God. It's not that hard. If you want to go ahead and activate that, pay half your life points, then activate like a power bond or something, then yes. But this card itself is not a fusion. Don't yeesh me. I'm freaking trying to tell you, and you're like, yeah, that's how it works. Like, no, it's not. God. People just throw cards in their deck, don't even read them, don't know how they fucking work. It's funny that you expect me to just let you take all that back. Technically, I don't even have to. You summoned that fucking Cyber Photon Dragon, you activated it, you paid half your life points. If you don't fusion summon this turn, then you just don't fusion summon this turn. It's funny you think that. This was fucking dev pro. You would have just paid half your life points for nothing. But at the end, I can do whatever I want. I can take my plays back. Like, thanks, thanks for making the game state irreparable. Like I said, you already committed to those plays. It's not my fault you're bad. But you just oh, let me just go ahead and take all my cards back and re and replay. Like nigga, no. Thanks for breaking the game state. You can't. 
you already committed to your place. No, it doesn't, no, it doesn't work like that. <laughs> you said I couldn't do it, so I put my place, so I put my cards back. Like, no, you can't fuse and summon. You still summon this, you still summon the, 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 the photon, the, yeah, the photon, and still play the card. Not my fault, not my fault you couldn't resolve it. No, no. That's how real life's duels. Hey guys, did you know in Yu-Gi-Oh, if you fucking misplay in Yu-Gi-Oh, you could take your shit back and do it again? No! <laughs> no! <laughs> no! Dicks these days. Nigga, you're the one that's fucking being a scrub. It's your fault. If we were dueling on Dead Pro and you went summon Photon and then played that card, pay half your life points and then fusion summon, that's your fault. You're the one that didn't fucking read the card, you fucking scrub. Like, wow. I'm not being a dick. I'm being fucking truthful. As if I'm gonna fucking just let you take all your fucking plays back and do a completely different play. That's not how Yu-Gi-Oh works. That's how I play Yu-Gi-Oh in real life. Then you and your little friends are fucking scrubs. You need to take your ass to a fucking tournament where a judge would be like, no, you already committed to the plays. <laughs> it's fucking stupid. See, and this is why I need the weekends off, people. This is the reason why I need the weekends off. And I'm gonna take my weekend off. I'll be back Monday. But god damn. <laughs> Ah! I know, you gotta get a fucking laugh out of it every single time. And I love all the support. You guys love to comment and laugh and like the video because it's funny because I'm losing my fucking shit dealing with fucking scrubs. But, I, I, you know what? I just need to take a break off. I need to take my weekends off. Oh my god, this is a job. Woo! Dealing with scrubs, trying to babysit people on DN. Oh, DN is where all the, duel, the pro players duel. No. DN is where all the fucking scrubs duel. Like, no. Both low rated and high rated, all of them are bad. <laughs> like it's like fucking DN. It gives you the ability to do whatever you want because it expects you. Thank you, thank you, sir. Know the fucking rules because it expects you to fucking play the game properly. I'm done. I'm done. So I hope that you guys got a laugh at me losing my shit. Like I said, I probably lost that duel anyway just because my hand was fucking completely ass. Ah, <sighs> just DM combined with give me ass hat hands, combined with number generator, just combined with fucking scrubs. It's just like, ah, oh, killing me. Killing me, people. It's killing me. <sighs> anyway, thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And I will see you guys uh, on Monday with, of course, you Bell trains. All right, people. Uh, I hope you guys will miss me a lot over the weekend. But, uh, yeah, see you guys on Monday.